Hey, good to see you. So, welcome in my studio. My name is Milo Friern and I want to give you a little tour in my workspace. Uh, we're at the center of Amsterdam and uh, well, of course, there's also beautiful museums in Amsterdam and this place, my, my working space, is also a little bit of a museum. And I want to start with my books, of course, because that's my profession, uh, picture bookmaker. And a few of my books are here. You may know um, Hair is a Family Affair is one of my books. And, of course, the Princess Arabella series. Princess Arabella is a big sister. But for now, I want to talk a little bit about... Princess Arabella at the museum and uh, well since I said my own studio is a bit of a museum I would like to give you a little tour so this is my uh, my cupboard with all the books and all the little dolls you can see here's my Arabella doll and uh, if we go a little further look at this a big collection of Barbie dolls my own very beautiful Barbie doll collection, black Barbie collection with uh, all these different hairstyles and uh, skin tones, which I'm very proud of. <laughs> now, if we continue, oh, look, here is Princess Arabella's dress. And I'm also dressed as Princess Arabella, as you can see. Well, um, here's a little closet with all the paints I use I use um, water inks, and as you can see, there are like a million different shades and tones of water skin, water uh, inks that I use. And here is a big drawer where I keep all my drawings. See, I'll show you. There's some more here. Here is, for instance, Princess Arabella and a grandma, and. Princess Arabella in the kitchen. So this is where I keep everything clean, flat and dry. So now we're at my working table and as you can see I have even more little jars with water inks and these are my little friends who sort of keep me company while I'm working. And as you can see here I have a big drawing of Princess Arabella. I already started working on her dress her own museum dress and I'll give you a little demonstration of how I work. So first I have to clean the brush of course. I take a little bit of blue here and for instance I'm going to fill in the blue here. I'm careful not to touch the other colors of course. As I know. And then I take Another color, the yellow, so we can see another color appear. For instance, look at that. There is the green, because blue and yellow, of course, make green. Now I have one more trick I want to show you, and that's, let me see what I can do. I can do it with blue also. Look. It's something I use a lot because I really love the effect. Let's see, first I'm going to make this blue. Then I'm going to take, look at this. What's in here is a little salt. Sprinkle it over the color, over the color blue. And you can see what happens. There's a sort of a chemical reaction. You can already see it at these little spots where I used it. And it gives a really nice effect. So it's, well, you could say it's almost making magic with, with the paint, with the water inks. And that's how I use all different sort of techniques. I have also little pastels and my, oh, my gel pens here, see? So that is how I make the drawings. So thanks for watching. And, um, well, if you've got some inspiration, just use it and uh, make your own beautiful drawing.